My name is Göran Johansson and I live in the southwest of Sweden and I'm a nature photographer and if you like what you have seen you can subscribe here. Helgoland is an island about uh, 70 kilometers from the German coast. The main island is about one square kilometers and uh, the island Dyne is about uh, 0 0.7 square kilometers. Well, today we are going to Germany, to Helgoland. So now we start the journey. Now we are uh, on our way on the bridge to Denmark. So here you can see uh, the big tower that, uh, and under this the boat will go. Now we are in Denmark and uh, on the right side you can see the island Saltön. Uh, the weather is perfect. As you see it's absolutely calm outside. We had to drive about 600 kilometers to come to Helgoland. And now we are driving under the water in a tunnel. Now we are driving over the big belt bridge in Denmark. And as you can see it's completely windless and it's very beautiful. Now we have arrived in Bysum and it's time to eat. Yes, Thomas, this is the night before we go out to Helgoland. Yes, very nice weather. It's uh, quiet. It's uh, sunny and um, <clears throat> the wind. So we hopefully <laughs> tomorrow will be a nice boat trip over to Helgoland. And the forecast for the two days we will be there will be good. Yes. We started the boat trip from Bysum at uh, 10 o'clock in the morning and it takes about four and a half hour to go out to Helgoland. It was perfect weather and uh, very calm. We went straight to the apartment we had rented. And then we went up to the Bird Mountain and the Red Rocks. Now we will photograph the Northern Gannet.
It's a very beautiful bird, but unfortunately they often build a nest with fishing nets, which means that they sometimes can get stuck and die. As you see, they live tight together. On the island, there are a nice walking path, and the red rocks create magic at sunset. The colony is very beautiful at sunset and it's important to keep the feathers in good condition. The last evening light illuminates the bird. If you subscribe now, you won't miss my next film, which is about the second island, Dyne, and its seals. <laughs>